This is verse 22 of the uh, 17th chapter of the Gospel of Matthew. If you've been following along, you notice we skipped uh, verse 21 because it's not in uh, any of the decent manuscripts of Matthew's Gospel. It's uh, the statement that says this kind only comes out by prayer and fasting. It seems to have been interpolated from other uh, contexts, but uh, at this point it doesn't seem to be a legitimate part of Matthew, so we're bypassing that. Brings us to verse 22. Uh, we have uh, sustrephomenon, interesting word, sustrepho. A combination of sus from sun means to gather, and strepho means to turn or to twist. Uh, it's uh, kind of unexpected here, but the sense of it is uh, that they were in the process of sort of twisting or going back and forth. It was uh, as if to suggest that Jesus remains in Galilee and that uh, in so doing he's going from here to there, uh, presumably very uh, visiting various cities and so on. It's part of a genitive absolute, so we'll notice here that it's in the present passive uh, participle, masculine plural genitive, the uh, uh, pronoun going along with it, out tone. So as they were going here and there, is the way we put it, uh, postpositive de, uh, in preposition with the dative te Galilea, uh, in Galilee. So uh, he continues there. Uh, he's uh, returned from uh, northern quarters and is back uh, now uh, visiting here and there communities in Galilee. And in so doing, apen, this is from Lego, I say, third person singular, aorist active indicative, autois, to them, indirect object, dative, masculine, plural. Uh, the subject of the verb, ho Jesus, Jesus uh, said to them, mele, from mello, I am going or I am about, usually takes the infinitive, which is what we have here. So uh, the subject of it, ho huios, the son, to anthropu, of man. Jesus' favorite designation for himself, uh, sometimes uh, simply a reference of uh, humility, his humanity, but of course it uh, always has uh, also within it a uh, little implication of the Daniel text and there's a surprise in this one. Uh, the Son of Man uh, typically f uh, pictured as a uh, character of great uh, uh, really deity of uh, great glory. Nevertheless the Son of Man Mele is about third person singular present active indicative uh, paradidosthai from paradidomi to be handed over it's the passive here passive infinitive, so the Son of Man is about to be handed over ace, preposition with the uh, accusative uh, uh, ros into the hands uh, of, uh, of anthropu, of men. Uh, so this once again is one of the warnings that Jesus gives to his disciples concerning the apparent catastrophe that's going to await them in Jerusalem. Of course, it's precisely the plan that must take place. Uh, Jesus foresees it and uh, warns his disciples. You may recall at the uh, uh, scene of the resurrection, the angel says to the women, don't you remember, or as he told you, in Galilee. Well, this is one of those occasions when in Galilee, Jesus advised the disciples that this was the uh, prospect that awaited him as he would uh, begin moving toward Jerusalem.